We have been buzzing about the news about blue eyes. Could they be more sensitive to the sun than brown eyes? And to find out, we reached out to, and well, in the words of Chuck Berry, a brown-eyed, handsome man, <laughs> ABC's John Berman. That's like the nicest thing anyone's ever said about me. Thank you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you always felt like blue-eyed guys and girls were getting all the attention, this is a story for you. Sure, blue eyes might help you get dates, but hits? That's a whole other story. Something in the way she moves. Old blue eyes, Frank Sinatra sure could sing. Paul Newman with those piercing blue eyes sure could act. I don't want to shoot with you, Harvey. But put them at bat during the day, and man, will they have problems. Hamilton struck out back in the first inning. Here's the Call it the me. curse of the baby blues. American League Most Valuable Player Josh Hamilton has been absolutely wretched during day games. He hits 200 points worse than at night. Why? The prognosis from Dr. Elton John. Baby's got blue eyes. Hamilton sure does, and some research has found that blue or light-colored eyes are worse at filtering glare. The reason? The pigment at the back of the eye is less dense. That pigment in the back of the eye is um, what helps us see our fine details. Which matters a lot in baseball, for airline pilots, truck drivers, anyone trying to see anything outside on a bright sunny day. Optometrist Justin Bazan says he gets a stream of complaints from blue-eyed patients about sensitivity to light, much more than from us brown-eyed guys. Yeah, it's a great looking iris. And brown-eyed girls. One other thing you should know about those blue-eyed folks? They're mutants. Not like the X-Men exactly, but scientists say it turns out that blue eyes did not exist until a genetic mutation no more than 10,000 years ago. And while they might have trouble hitting, it doesn't seem to get in the way of anyone's fame or fortune. Now it does turn out there is a solution for this epic problem for blue-eyed people. Sunglasses, they can make all the difference. And I should note, there have been some fairly decent blue-eyed baseball players. Oh, Ripken? Yeah, guys named Ripken, Mantle, and someone named Lou Gehrig. Yeah, it didn't keep Ripken from playing in 2,632 consecutive games, but... They did you know, okay. Yeah. But I see blue eyes, that you were called a mutant, Sam, a uh, dense... <laughs> um, mutant. Mutant was my favorite. Yeah. This, this is why we should move our softball games tonight. So that's been the problem with you at, at yeah. the plate, those yeah, afternoon like I'm games. Play softball for <laughs> it was worth a shot. Hey, John, thank you.